In 1964, radio astronomers Arno Penzias and Robert Wilson at Bell Labs encountered an unexplained microwave noise while calibrating their horn antenna. Despite meticulous efforts to eliminate interference, from checking equipment to removing pigeon nests, the persistent signal remained. This baffling discovery would later be recognized as the Cosmic Microwave Background CNB the afterglow of the Big Bang, providing the first direct evidence of the universe's explosive origin. Determined to solve the mystery, Penzias and Wilson systematically ruled out all local sources of interference. They scrubbed the antenna of pigeon droppings, tested wiring, and even considered military radar signals. Yet the noise persisted uniformly across the sky. Their frustration grew, but their rigorous methodology would soon lead them to a groundbreaking realization. This was no earthly disturbance, but a cosmic echo from the dawn of time. Consulting physicist Robert Dickey, Penzias and Wilson learned their noise match predictions for the CMB, thermal radiation from the universe's infancy. Dickey's team had theorized this remnant glow, but the Bell Labs duo had accidentally found it. The discovery confirmed the Big Bang theory, showing the universe began as a hot, dense state 13.8 billion years ago. This monumental revelation earned them the 1978 Nobel Prize in Physics. The CMB discovery revolutionized cosmology, becoming the cornerstone of modern astrophysics. Subsequent missions like COBE, WMAP, and Planck mapped its tiny fluctuations, revealing the universe's composition, 69% dark energy, 26% dark matter. These anisotropies validated cosmic inflation and the Lambda CDM model. Today, the CMB remains a time capsule, offering unparalleled insights into the universe's birth, structure, and ultimate fate.